Loser. Die Saison ist eröffnet, es ist ein wahres Spektakel, denn alle kommen, weil es abgeht. Das ist eine riesengroße Party, reiß die Arme. Okay, welcome to the Helen Show. Today we have a very special guest for you today. Karl Friedrich Gauss. So, you were born in Germany, right Gauss? Tell us about your childhood. How did it help you become such a great mathematician? Uh, well, yes. Yeah, I was born in Germany mm -hmm. to a bricklayer, oh. surprisingly, that was my father, yeah. And he actually didn't want me to be a mathematician, he wanted me oh, to... Oh, no! I uh, know, why, why would you want to face genius like this laying brick? I don't know, I don't know, okay. But uh, he wanted me to do family trade, but oh. my mother and uncle saw that I was very smart and I should go to school. So, uh, so they paid for your education? Uh, not quite, but uh, you know, like my mother and my uncle, my teacher saw that I was super student. Ah, yes, we actually have a clip of you from when you were in uh, school, when you were a small child. But Tell me if you remember this. that teacher very much. He ended up uh, realizing how smart I was in school and I realized how smart I was in school and that's how I was able so, to get support. So it was your teachers that paid for your college then? Uh, not quite. The Duke of um, Braschenwege, he was very impressed with my abilities, my photographic memory especially. Mm. And so he had a lot of money he gave me the money to go to the uh, Colleague Carolinum, and then after that we went to University of Gottingham. Oh, that is terrific! Yes. You know, Gauss, when I was little, I wanted to be a ballerina, or the bullfighter. Mm -hmm. When you were little, did you know that you wanted to be a mathematician? Uh, not exactly. When I first got into college, I had the interest in the languages. And, um, but I was so smart and multi-talented, that I just decided to go into mathematics, see what I can do, and I ended up being able to construct the decagon with um, what what are they called? Straight edge and the compass. And so so when you uh, created the half the decagon, it made you want to go into math. Yeah, yes? yeah. Ah. So what a coincidence! I happen to have straight edge and compass right here. Oh. Would you be kind enough to yeah, show us yeah, how to make a course, half the decagon? Of course, of course. Ta-da! Here is the decagon. Wow! That's so impressive! Yes, 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 Look at that, everybody! Yeah, this is for you, Look this at is for this! You. Wow! Thank you! You're Isn't welcome. that impressive, everybody? No problem, no problem. So, I need a... I need a little break from all of this because, uh, man, that was... That was awesome! That was good, that was good. That was amazing. <laughs> so, we are all going to take a break and go to the most recent Dance Dare submission. Yay! I'm sexy and I know it. I'm sexy and I know it. Yeah! When I'm at the mall, security just can't fight them all. 
And when I'm at the beach, I'm in a speedo trying to tear my cheek. Ha ha, I just love dancers. Oh, yes. Anyways, so Mr. Gauss, tell me about your family. Uh, you, uh, you has children, ja? Ja, I have six children. We have Joseph, Wilhelm, Wilhelm, and uh, Georgine, uh, Louis, and Teres. So, six children. What a beautiful family. Yeah. Are they going into mathematics too? No. No, no, no. Why? They, they're not smart enough. They will hurt family name. Oh. So, tell me, Gauss, how is your wife? Oh, which one? Johanna? Yeah, Johanna. Uh, Johanna. Jo Johanna passed away last year. Oh yeah, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. So what? But the, but the, it's, okay. it's okay. It's okay. I married her best friend. Very happy for you. Now, as you know, I love to give away free stuff on my show. But the winner needs to earn it by playing Gauss said what. That's what makes you beautiful. So the rules for Gauss and Vat is that our helper, Andy, will say quotes from different people, including our guest star, Gauss. And a member from the audience will guess whether or not the quote was from Gauss. If the member of the audience gets three of the four quotes correct, they will get a prize. Okay, so now we have to pick a member from the audience. You! Come on down. What is your name? Olivia. And you? Mathematicians stand on each other's shoulders. Oh, oh, I know who that is. That is Gauss. That is Gauss. That is Gauss. Yes, me. yes, that is me. Oh, yes, it is very true. Mathematicians must rely on each other because you must take what is found in the past and use it to build upon the present, and then you can move on to the future. Yorika, Yorika. Okay. That is not Gauss. Not Gauss! Not me. Mathematicians have tried in vain to this day to discover some order in the sequence of prime numbers. It is a mystery into which the human mind will never penetrate. I do not think this is Gauss. Correct, I said no such thing. <laughs> Sounds like Gauss? Ja, it is me. Paco said Latura. Oh, oh, I know this one. This is, your, this is your motto, Gauss. I am your biggest fan. Ja, this is my motto. There is much work that I have done in the past years, but I have not published any of it because I do not want the public to see it unless it is finished and I have completed all my work because I do not want them to think I am idiot like other mathematician. Hey, cut that out. Okay, now because the Kaiser wants all television shows to be educational, we have mathematical concept time. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Oh yes, this is my favorite part of show. Okay. Concept number one, Gauss's law. Some people call it the flux theorem, but uh, basically this is what happens. Generally, you would use this equation right here, and you calculate total uh, electrical flux through a closed and closed surface, or the total charge that is enclosed by the surface, and you use the equation. Okay, moving on. Can you tell us about your triangular number theory? Aha! Yes! Triangular number theory. Uh, I proved this and basically what it says is that any number above one, mm. 
You can use any triangular number as long as it's under three triangular numbers and the sum of them will equal that number. So uh, for example, if you had four, you could use one plus three and you should get four. Now if you were to use, let's say, a bigger number, maybe 20, you get triangular number 10 plus 10 and you so, get So, wait, wait, let me, get, let me get this right. So any number in the entire world that you want to put three or less numbers, you can just use the sum. Yes, of you just you just use triangles. Wow, how ah. did you do that? You're very smart. I know. I, I could never figure that. Yeah, out. I know you could. Well, that is all the time we have today. I want to give a big danke to Mr. Gauss. See you all next time of Wiedersehen.